What is up guys, Cleef101 here, and today I am bringing you episode 89 of Road to Remake. In the last episode, we left you, I, we left you, I left you, with about to being, well, we're about to face off with the Turks again for the last time. We get to face all three of them at once. Now, normally you would steal from these guys, but I don't need to, so I'm not going to. And we'll just pick up right where we left off. We're Turks, Elena. Yes, sir, you're right. Going up. Come on, we've got work to do. I'm not really up for it, but... Our orders were to seek you out and kill. Our company may be in turmoil, but an order's an order. That's the spirit of the Turks. Believe it. Naruto, anyone? What are you doing? Let's go! Okay, let's do this. I know we have a weird relationship, but we have to end this, like Turks. Barrett just aims at the ceiling, like that's gonna do much. <laughs> um, magic breath? Yeah, let's get a magic. Oh! Shit balls! Holy shit balls! Are you kidding me? What the fuck was that? And that, wow! And that just straight up hit him. Yeah, right. I'm dying. <laughs> I, I'm dying. Oh dear. Ah, uh, there goes Cloud. Shit. That first hit was just, what the fuck? And I haven't saved this, so I can't actually afford to die. <laughs> okay. Time to be a bit serious. Uh, oh, Thank you. Thank you, Elixir. Yeah, let's just go another one. We'll go. I don't care. Come on, give me my turns, please. There we go. And then the Mega Elixir, please. And then everything will be fine. Hey! Get fucked. Let's get you out. Right. We're good now. I should actually... Jesus Christ, I cannot believe how dangerous that is. Um... I'm not actually sure what I'm doing right now. Uh, let's just take one of them out at least. Okay, 2,399, that's fine. And then long range. Yeah, that's so much more damage than I'd be doing with, any with anything else. On one opponent, anyway. Let's get rid of Elena. She's taking the most damage out of everyone so far. Got another Mega Lips in there. And, do you know what? Let's chuck a Tranquilizer on you while we're at it. A boost. Jesus Christ, I, am, I can't believe how strong these guys are. I completely forgot about this. I might not be in the best space to fight any kind of boss. Proud Clod could pose as a bit of a threat to me. Hmm, holy shit. Rude's fucking strong, man. <laughs> Alright, so Tranquilizer's gonna help. That's good. Let's, uh, let's really minimize this damage. I gotta get, uh, Sid into that back row, too. Uh, Phoenix down on you, and then a Mega Elixir again. I love, I love Mega Elixirs. <laughs> I literally cannot be beaten with them. Unless, you know, shit like this happens. Get back. Oh, jeez. Get back. How much health does Elena have? I'm doing like 7k damage per hit. Uh, you got to change into the back row, man. You're getting smashed. Uh, okay, so let's get a, uh, where is it? Tranquilizer on you. Oh, there we go. Uh-huh. There that goes. Yeah, I showed you I wasn't panicking at all. Hey, hey, hey. 
Man, they hit hard. I'm supposed to be a bit stronger than what I am, but Jesus. Hey, can I just get another level up on that all? <laughs> That's sick. Alright. Uh, okay, so I do actually, do you know what? <laughs> While I'm doing this, that was a bit risky. Um, and you guys are going back there. Yeah, how nah am I dealing with that again? Alright. So, um, Shinra, Shinra man, Shinra building, yeah. <laughs> come on, come on, come on, come on, come on! Right, fair enough. I'm supposed to go left there, I'm pretty sure, but I don't... Oh, hello. I'm alright, go to the cannon. Okay, so I'm supposed to go right here anyway, but I want to keep going right. I think I'm supposed to go left there, perhaps. I'm pretty sure. Oh, do you know what? Let's use this bitty. <laughs> you are so dead, little dude. You are, you don't even know what kind of dead you are right now. <laughs> Too bad you slowed me, you bastard. Yeah, jeez. I completely. I didn't even think. I thought. I genuinely thought that that was going to be a walkover boss. You know, nothing in it. Don't. You know, no need to panic. And then, bam! I just come out with that fucking strong hits and shit. And cloud goes down. And I'm like, whoa! Let's uh, let's take this a little bit more seriously, shall we? Stupid Turks. That's the hardest Turk fight that we've had, and they saves it until the very end of the game almost. I was actually fearful that I was going to get a game over. That's uh, that's the kind of peril that they were putting me in at that point. Well, that's a good thing that they kind of suck. Did Cloud get his HP plus leveled up as well? I think he did in that last battle, which is good. Wait, really? I thought that was like a ladder here or something. Shit. Well, that's changed my plan now. I thought, um, okay. Right. I'm not sure this is the right one that I need to go in. Apparently it is. Well, that's good then. <laughs> uh, so I want to come in here. I'm pretty sure there's a save point at the front of the building still. And I want to use the PHS. Yep, I know. Oh no! This is the raise, not this way. Yeah, I know. But I want you in my party. I don't need you to be particularly powerful or anything, old log, so I don't need, uh... I'm pretty sure I'm versing all of the disc one enemies here too. <laughs> yeah, I am. <laughs> that's just overkill, bro. Oh, that's way overkill. Uh, Jesus Christ. <laughs> uh, I gotta remember which floor that I need to go to. So I think I'll just climb the stairs because I've still got past 65, um, which will get me to at least level 65, really. So, um, where do these go? Come on, get in there! Analog sticks, man, they don't work with this game like at all and it's really annoying. I'm just gonna keep trying them uh, because well, I don't need to try them now. God damn it. Because I just want as many kills for Cloud as I can get. The thing that I'm most concerned about getting the kills for these things is when I first Tomberries in the Northern Cave and I want to, to be able to morph them into ribbons for everyone. I'm. Cloud's gonna be really hurt, like a lot of the time. Now, which floor is this gonna take me to? Because I'm pretty sure this goes all the way up. It's like 66 or something. Would you let me go up? All right, let's go 65. I don't think it's 65 that I need to go to. I think it's like 63. I think 63 is the floor that I need to get to. Yeah, definitely not this floor. All right, so we're gonna go down. It's, uh, yeah, this one here. 64. Alright, so we've got Kaisis in our team. His ultimate weapon is right here. HP shot, thank you. 
And that's that. Uh, why don't we go back to the elevator? And now we can go to the actual sister ray and fight the boss. Proud Oh wow, we've got Proud Claw to beat. We've got Hojo to beat. Hojo is gonna be particularly difficult. Not specifically for Cloud, because he's got a ribbon on. Um, but for the rest of the party members that are gonna be in the party, it's going to be difficult because he inflicts a lot of statuses and stuff on my on my party, if I remember correctly. Which is quite annoying. Alright, let's get your ass out of here and get you back in. In. There we go. Boom, boom. Boom, boom. Now, I gotta go back one screen and go left. So one screen, I mean three screens actually, but I gotta go to the other junction and go left, and that will get me to the right place, I'm pretty sure. Why are you not letting me go back? Are you kidding me right now? Thank you. Let's see, teeth is gone. Nice of her to just leave me in the dead. Let's get some more mega elixirs because I think I went through a few. Just get up to 29, and then I will be. I could just leave it here actually, and I'd be happy, but. I really hope they leave this glitch in the game because it's so good. <laughs> it's, it's such a good glitch. Come on, when is it Cloud's turn now? You guys have been going for eight. I went from 50 to 99 with Mega Elixirs, and you are still not dead. Like, I haven't even had one single attack in yet. That's a bit ridiculous, don't you think? Not very cohesive for a, uh, for a speed run or anything. No, is it? Yeah, just, yeah. Attack him so he can kill you. More kills for Thank you. God damn it. How far away is he from getting bloody Meteor Rain? He doesn't have it now, does he? No, I didn't think so. I just had to make sure, though. Right, keep going. Keep rolling, 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 rolling. Ha! What is it with you and not going back through? Alright. This is worrying now. This is this is the fight that counts. The proud clog is painful can be very painful, can hit very, very hard, and I, I am, I am actually very concerned right now. Hey, hey, you serious? <laughs> Here they come. <laughs> so they really showed up. Look at them. Heidegger's not even on my hand. Jesus Christ, he's a wizard. You sure treated us like dogs until now. You killed many of my precious soldiers. <laughs> but let's see how you do against anti-weapon artillery. You guys are worthless, but my proud creation is great. I'll show you the destructive power of the Proud Cloud. Alright, boss battle, here we go. I should have started a new episode with this, but I'm hoping that I can get this done very quickly. Wow, yeah, no damage there. Let's bust a Kajada on you, and let's get a Alexander on you. Alright, Materia Gem. Oh, well, that's not very nice now, is it? Is that on everyone or just. Wow, you suck. Does that mean I can't actually do anything? I'll, I'll give it a go. 
I'm not sure. I'll give it one go, and if it does mean that I can't do that, then that's going to make things slightly more difficult. Not impossible, but it's going to drag things out longer. I kind of wish I had sense, because then I'd be able to sense and constantly keep an eye on how much health they have. I'm not sure how much the Bolt 3 actually managed to do. I'm, I'm a little concerned with that material gem. If, if that is actually the case, I don't think I can get rid of it. There's nothing to actually show me that it's on. Alexander's a boss. He's a boss. Oh, material gem is straight off the bat. I can't believe that. Because he's got Bahama at zero and, oh. He sucks. All right, can he? It's working. That's odd. I don't want to be using that though because it uses a lot of MP for, let's be honest, shitty damage. Compared to what he can put out with, you know, bolt throwing attack, the damage, the damage isn't great. And it's split between the two things. So I want to just destroy one thing. I can't remember which one has more health and which one has less health. But I just want to get it down. That's all I care about right now. And he hasn't actually... Crackle's not actually done really much of anything to me. Which is good news. So you've got Biofly 3. We've got another Odin. But I don't think it's going to be much worth anything. What do I actually have in here that might be able to do some damage? Daisies? I might use a dragon phone. Should be fine. 3,000 damage. I love you, Bahamut. Too bad. I can actually use my other... Oh my goodness. I can use Bahamut Zero and stuff. I'm so stupid sometimes, I swear to God. You are doing like no damage to me and I'm loving it right now. Being back row, sadness, it is great. I don't even need to use all of my Mega Elixirs. They will come very, very handy later. Okay, so you're doing about 4,000 damage. Let's go to Bahamut Zero on them and see how happy they are with me after that. 800 damage from you. Alright, let's just get another one oh, really? See, I don't like my damage output. I feel like I'm very weak. I feel like I should be doing more damage than I currently am. Because I'm pretty sure this this guy's got a fair bit of HP. And if that's the case, and this fight can drag out for a while, I, I don't want it to. Knee bend? What are you doing? I just want to get my MP back up. I want to use something else as well. What else can I use? You know what, let's... I don't know if it's immune to Demi, but we'll give it a go. I mean, it, it's not exactly a wasted attack. I have to use something else, so... Testing what can be used is not necessarily a bad thing. Look at him, Bahamu Zero. Now he is definitely king of the dragons. Not even king of the summons, but king of the dragons. That is right. Oh, yeah. It just like opens up the heavens. That's, that's what that did just now. It, it opened up the heavens. 7,000 each? 8,000 each. Oh, yes. Alright, so i got to destroy the other thing now. Let's get a big apartment in. I got that in. Yay! Another Odin. Alright, so we're not tracking too bad. One, one of the things... One of the things has been destroyed. That's good. We've just got to destroy the body of it now. Again, I don't know how much health it's got, but I'm just hoping it's not too long. So we're cracking 20 minutes of the video soon. Jesus. Is Fire 3 even going to work on you? It's probably better than attacking, I suppose. 
Yeah, give me my, give me my MP back. Yeah, all right. I didn't think that that'll work. Never does against bosses. All right, so you've got Ultima. Why have I not been using Ultima? Jesus Christ, there's going to be doing so much more damage than any of your summons. Honestly, I amaze myself at how much I forget and how stupid I am sometimes. Seriously, it's uh, it's not a good combination, unfortunately. <laughs> I've got Fire 3 being used by Azza. <laughs> uh, right, if I can just destroy this thing, then I can start pre-planning and everything for Hojo. That is a boss battle that I'm generally afraid. I was generally afraid of this one because I thought it was harder than this, but this isn't easy for me. It's just long. Pain in the ass long is what it is. Right, back to doing the Vault 3s then. Okay, well that wasn't too bad. Hey, are you dead now? No, you're just... Right, yeah, you're, getting, you're actually getting on your knees for me. Yeah, you beg for a forgiveness. This is the most powerful magic in the game. Like, as, it, as magic goes, and in Barrett's hands, it's shit, but it's better than doing his, like, probably 400 attack damage. <laughs> Yeah, Cloud's my powerhouse right now. He's doing like close to 5k damage. If not over, actually. So 2,000, five, so I'm doing roughly, between the three of them, about 7 to 8k damage. So I can't really ask for too much more than that. It's actually pretty good for this point in the game. What are you doing? Not much of anything, apparently. And then you take up a huge amount of time in your animation of standing back up. So in this episode, so in this episode, we've actually gone through two boss fights. We have one more to go for Midgar, and then we'll have another four to go until the end of the game. And then that's that's it. That'll be end of the game. That's pretty sick. Come on, you got to be almost gone. See now, MP absorb on Ultima right there which is funny because he's <laughs> he's using Ultima and his name is Ultima I could not have planned that any better every time he uses Ultima he gains back some MP and the only reason he's able to use this next attack uh, of Ultima is because he had MP absorber that whole time otherwise I, I wouldn't be able to use this all right let's just regain all of my MP back so I can start busting out some more attacks. How much health do you have? Oh, there we go. Finally! Poison was born. Wow. Nice. All right, let's go through this. Oh, there's Ragnarok. Don't need it though. I've got a weapon that's better than that. <laughs> so Ragnarok is basically Cloud's best weapon other than his ultimate weapon. And guys, I'm going to leave this episode here because it's super long and I'm sure you don't want to be sitting much more through this episode. We will continue this episode, or we'll continue the story and the game and everything in the next episode. Hopefully we can finish that episode in a timely manner, get out, finish Midgar and be done with Midgar by episode 90. Yeah, that's right. <laughs> Anyway, guys, I'm Cleef101. Thank you very much for watching this video, and I will see you next time. Bye.